Well, hello. Um, this is the fight for Skellige's Most Wanted contract. And it's a quest I've never done before. And it was quite a lot of fun. Um, so I, had, I, I went into it totally blind. And uh, there, was, there was one part I thought that was pretty tough. And then uh, you eventually get to this thing. So I was quite surprised what happened. Um, I, I, when I was recording, I'm recording this from desktop, by the way. Um, so I'm, I'm, I'm going to leave in the, the dialogue and things, um, and I'll put it in a thing if you want to skip that. And, uh, the fight, the fight was pretty tough, I thought, because of the way, because of the way it goes. Anyways, um, so first comes the dialogue, and then, uh, then I'll pause again. Must be the place. You can come out. I've seen your plan. Besides, I can hear you. One of you's wheezing like a broken bellows. Another's panting frantically like a deer caught in a trap. And the third should really take something for that throat. I'd try time extract. Someone care to explain what's going on here? What's going on is that you're down there, and we're up here! That's a situation I can fix quickly. Glitchy thingy no dum dum! The pounding glitchy thingy swoop man! That's right! We've caught you! You're at our mercy now, and we're none too merciful! Oh really? Fact is, I could just turn around and... Bloody toad! Glitchy thingy, gum gum, shocking. Well, swoop, Meg. I wonder why he's not already in that shrimp. You were to kill him. <sighs> what? We never said nothing about killing. Not a thing. We were just supposed to scare him. So, glitchy thingy, us scary thingies. Make him no touch us. I believe you misunderstood. <sighs> He's a murderer. Like the rest of them. Like the one who killed my Adalia. <sighs> <clears throat> Awful sorry about your wench. We all are. A doubler. But this Witcher didn't kill her. And we can't very well punish him for another's crime. He has much to answer for, too. <sighs> I heard he killed a Korrid in Tucson. But he spared a golden dragon. So what? What about Verena, the Bruxa with the fondness for blue roses from Nazaire? He showed her no mercy. <sighs> I really don't know what he's talking about. I've not played the DLC. If that's from the DLC, I have no idea. True. I killed Verena. Bit of a spoiler. But you still got a chance. Could still leave with your lives. Let's part in peace before someone gets hurt. <sighs> Is that a threat? I'm trying to save your lives. Won't touch you as long as you don't attack. But one false move and I'll have to defend myself. Uh, just remembered. I left a cauldron on the fire. Any other cowards? Pull the uncommon! Three against one? We might stand a chance. Ah! Get him! Ah! Let's turn that down. Well, that maybe not all the way down. <clears throat> so, the fight is difficult because there's three of them. And one of them, you fight with a silver sword. There was a bit of lag there. See, it switches swords. And then you have a problem, right? Because then these two are for steel. And this is a cursed enemy. So, silver. 
And uh, if you keep going back and forth, you keep switching swords, and yeah, <laughs> so it's not so not so not so good. Anyhow, so my my plan was to get rid of the Doppler, okay, and then the werewolf. Doppler because he can move fast and it's annoying, and then I just have <clears throat> these two enemies to balance. So I divert the troll as long as possible, and then go for the werewolf first. <clears throat> Try not to switch swords and things like that. So, um, you know, this fight is a collection of you know failures. I didn't I didn't show when I defeated him. That was a, a bit later. I'll put it that way. <laughs> but uh, yeah. So I do have the uh, as you can see the perk for poison is super useful <clears throat> for the poison blades and then if I have a uh, sword that does poison or bleed or whatever too. It's pretty handy, I have to say. I understand that I'm rolling too much, but I'm quite worried about getting boxed in because if everyone's just, you know, wailing on me, see then you take a big hit and you're already totally screwed because your stamina is going to be regenerating incredibly low, especially if you're rolling around like I am. And then I have one cast left. Okay, and then you're straight out of luck because it's not like you're gonna. I'm not like I'm using a uh, decoction for heal self. Okay, besides swallow. So yeah. Oh, that was close. I'm rolling now. Kind of panicking. Kind of panicking. I have the. Oh yeah, that was that was interesting. I ha did you see what happened there? I have the perks for where is it now? I have the perks for the, um, um, you know, where you, someone swings your sword and you kind of parry him or whatever. Then you hit him back and you do big damage, <clears throat> as you saw there. Uh, but I was hitting him back, doing big damage, and then that troll threw a rock. Hit me right in the face. Boom. Game over. So, shook the mouse a bit at that frustration. Now, as you see next, I just uh, <clears throat> fast forwarded through all the all the um, dialogue. I quite like Skellige, like a lot. Um, I live in le Western Norway, in case you didn't know, and it looks kind of similar to a lot of the places around here. That's that's fair to say. So, or at least some islands do. So yeah, kind of cool. Kind of cool. Um, I'm not sure why that loading screen. I guess it's not super long. Super long. Getting swarmed by enemies is really killer. Uh, because of the way the poise works, you really can't. You know, you're not going to poise through a ton of enemies unless you're. I'm wearing medium armor. You can poise through a few things, but you have to be really careful. Um, you know, so three or four drowners, three or four uh, necrophages or whatever, neckers, um, it can get really rough. So, even a single tough enemy is my preferred way of doing things. So now I try, I try to get in, you know, a cheeky little fire, because <clears throat> I know if I get hit, then I'm just going to lose all my... So I'm, I'm trying to get a cheeky and, and get off like a bleed on him or something. So he loses health, and then I can try and make space for myself. So I don't want to hit the Doppler, because I don't want to switch swords. And no matter. Right now I'm super boxed in. Look at that. I was so nervous. <laughs> I was like, oh shit. <laughs> so, so you can, you can parry the werewolf, so to speak. And now, as you can see, I'm totally screwed. How long are you gonna yep. make me wait? And then, you know, Garrett's talking smack, but he's already dead. Because that, uh, the werewolf has kind of a fast, you know, where he shoves his hand out. It's kind of, it's kind of nasty. Anyways, that's the two fights I'm gonna show. And, uh, yeah. So that's the two fights I'm gonna show, and, um, it's a rough fight. I did manage to defeat 
But that was after several tries, like multiple tries. So, yeah. Anyways, I uh, hope this wasn't too dull. It's, it's, it's cool stuff. It's interesting to show, you know, interesting fights and dynamics with, um, with what's going on. But, yeah, hope you're doing well.